Shallism, or housemate is little freaky. What is she even doing over there? It's like she's living in her own world. I know. Janice has been even loopier than usual since she came back from that cruise. Did I mention the ridiculous little shrine she set up in her bedroom? Oh yeah, and I swear I can hear her in there chanting or something at night. You know, part of the reason for this outing was just to get her out of the house. I don't think she's gone anywhere in the two weeks since she got back from her trip. Yikes. And do you think alcohol and a little fresh air is going to cure that? No way. I confess I had less than honorable motives. Once she was out of the house, I stole the damn idol thing off her little dresser shrine. Some creepy statue she got on her trip. I'm going to give it to Barry as a gag gift. She wouldn't even come unless we walked here. Serious public transit phobia if you ask me. No kidding. And hey, I didn't realize you were still seeing Barry. Yeah, we're spending the weekend together. I'm leaving tonight. Oh, tonight? I heard that the weather is going to be foul. Are you going to make it all the way there in that old wreck of yours? God, no. I figured I better not chance it. I'm going to take the train instead. Barry said he'd pick me up at the station. By the way, can you give me a lift to the train station in Edinburgh? Not tonight, Alison. I have to work. What about your friend Nancy? Are you kidding me? Once Nancy finds out I'm going to see Barry, I'll be a captive audience for her whining the whole way there about how mean he is to her. No thanks. I'll just call a cab. Boy, talk about being captive audience for some whining. Oh, hey, hold on a sec. I just happened to have a pass for a free cab ride. I met this guy at the festival who runs his own taxi service. Oh no, is he one of those super chatty ones? No. Definitely not that. Not really that talkative at all. In fact, I'm pretty sure I was the one who did all the talking. Maybe his English isn't good. I think he races cars too, or maybe he used to. Oh good. Then he better be on time and get me to the train station fast. I heard that you race cars. I need to get to the train station. Take a direct route. You're not getting a tip if you take me down unnecessary roads to get there. What did I tell you about unnecessary roads? Is this some silly shortcut of yours? Where are we anyway? Are those train tracks? So I guess I need to give you a little credit for finding a direct route.
Wow. Okay. This is a little too direct. Do they still run trains on this track? How can you even see anything in this fog? Hey, whoa, hold on now. This is way too dangerous. There's nowhere to go if the train comes while we're on this bridge. You're starting to really scare me now. Stop it. This is crazy. What? No no no. I don't mean stop the car on the bridge. Come on, get us out of here. Get us out of here before a train comes. Oh no, I think I hear something. Come on, come on, move it. You're going to get us both killed. That was way too close. Are we even near the station yet? This? No, you bonehead. This isn't the train station. I'm beginning to think I would have been better off driving myself. This is like an abandoned depot or something. This place is super creepy. Do you even see anybody else around here? Train stations are full of people coming and going. This place is completely deserted. There's not another car, bus, or taxi. Got to be kidding me. Okay, I don't know what that's all about, but it proves nothing. This isn't the train station. Take me to the passenger trains. The passenger trains in Edinburgh. I'm very late now. Just find a route that avoids traffic. Oh, thank goodness. You're still driving on the tracks after what just happened? There has to be another way to get to the rail station from here. Can we get off the tracks now? Look, a great crossing. Here, pull off here. Stop, stop right now. All right, buddy. When I said not to take any unnecessary roads, I didn't mean that all roads were unnecessary. In case you haven't figured it out by now, Driving on the tracks is a really stupid idea, especially in this fog. I mean, who does stuff like that? Nobody drives on train tracks to get to the station. Seriously, do those guys just follow you around? Stay off the train tracks, got it? Yikes, have you got something against roads in general?
Ugh, I'm sorry pal, but you make a better race car driver than you do a cabbie. In fact you really stink at it. This isn't the passenger drop-off area. Take me to the... You know what? On second thought, just forget it. I'm just going to get out here. You might just as well leave me in the middle of nowhere. What the heck? Where am I? Hello? Oh, hello? Is there anybody out here? Somebody? Anybody? Hello? sounds really great Janice. So I guess that girls day out last week really did improve your spirits, eh? Oh yeah, it's like a spell has been broken. It's good to see you out and about, but what about Alison? Is she doing any better? Oh, no change in the last several days. Poor thing. It's almost like she's living in another dimension or something. <laughs> 